Hi, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Emily Hessler and today I have a Halloween card for you. I started with a light grey cardstock panel here and I am using a stencil from Echo Park. This uh, is a spider web uh, stencil and I'm applying a bit of uh, texture paste optic matte from Ranger uh, through the stencil with my palette knife and I'm doing it quite a thin layer. I just want this to have a um, nice coverage and I'm trying to get it kind of even and uh, when I'm done uh, or actually I should say when I'm happy with it I remove the stencil and then I'm covering this entire panel with some uh, white glitter from C6 and I'm, I did this before the embossing paste was fully dried so that it's adhering to the embossing paste and you can see I'm not that careful with this panel it's quite dry at this point uh, after that I let this dry uh, completely and um, I started to work on the sentiment for this card. I used another uh, die set from C6 and uh, in this die set it, it's all these big letters and I decided to go with the one that says Fright and I die cut, it out of, I die -cut this die out of some black cardstock a couple of times, I think it was uh, three times and I'd hear them together so it got a thicker die cut piece and I also used this die set from C6 called Halloween set and from this I just used the bat image and I also die cut that, die -cut that out of <laughs> black cardstock a couple of times and uh, these ones I didn't adhere together so these are just one layers and I think that gives a good contrast to the thicker uh, focal point on this card that is the background and uh, this fright piece. So I'm scattering these bats around my background and that is pretty much it. Um, if you like this card please give it a thumb up and you can also subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so. I will be back soon with another card project for you and I hope you have a good day in the next time. Bye!